Chloe. I am the first guy to do this challenge. It's think time, everyone. Think time. Today we got abs, we got booty, and we finally, finally got some guys. So it's been a while since my last results video and you guys are not making it easy for me. There are like 97 videos to review. That's insane! That's 13 hours, 15 minutes. I'll probably be able to review a couple of videos today, but I'll do another one next week. All these results are amazing. Oh my god, these have to be seen. And I know how much effort you guys put into filming yourself over like 14 days or 30 days. So I'll try my best to include them all. I wasn't committed to it. I was just... just eating and the more i ate i just kept getting bigger and i felt more gross and i'm like okay okay i gotta start grinding i was just not happy anymore i started going to the gym very seriously in september chloe i love you and i hope you love my results just as much as i do so this is a video of when i first started the challenge just wanted to show you guys what i started off with wow looking back at it it's like i was really that big Holy shit! My body now. You're so toned! Is that 35 days? Are you sure that's just 35 days? It's really shocking, you guys. It's kind of weird, oh it's kind of weird but yes. I'm definitely really proud of myself for this. I think I did good. We're starting to see something here, I think. You can see the definition on your abs and your butt, girl. I definitely feel like this challenge made me stronger. It just opened my mind to a lot of things, you know, like made me really consider more of muscle mind connection when I do my exercises, more about squeezing yes, the butt when you go at the end of your butt. hip thrust. Mm, it's about squeezing, squeezing, thrusting, feeling, all about that stuff. I have applause for the people who did this challenge, for me, for people watching this video, and for Chloe too. Ah! That was amazing! Oh my god, I love that you're so confident. You're so cute. <laughs> It's so amazing what you can do in 35 days. Like, I'm so impressed. Thank you so much for making this video. All the links of everyone's videos are in the description box. So go and check them out and give K some love. You know, give everyone some love. They're amazing. You're so much more confident now. I can see you're, you're really happy. So I'm really, really happy for you. I am the first guy to do this challenge. I am doing the Chloe Teen Challenge. Now this challenge is designed to give you the abs you want. It is designed to turn that fat into all that. It is designed to transform your body. You guys are gonna see the before and after results of my abs. He's so much more convincing than I am. <laughs> He's gonna be in all my videos now. Day 14. Cool. All right, y'all, so I just finished the video and um, I got some pretty good results. I'm, I'm very, very happy about it. I feel a lot more of my abs. I feel tighter. I even feel like lighter too. So happy to um, I encourage that. a lot of more men to do this challenge. Um, actually, they actually, Yes, men do this challenge too. <laughs> I just can't believe it actually worked. But anyway, show you guys the before and after pics. So results! I'm so excited. More. Holy shit! I can see like the six pack forming, yo! Obliques! Oh my god, I love your result! Thank you so much for filming your results video. Like, I'm so happy that it worked out for you and you're my hype man! It is designed to transform your body. Why do guys get so shocked that they can get results from my workouts? Like, it's designed for everyone. It's just because I'm a girl doesn't mean that it doesn't work for guys, you know? So I want to preface this video by saying I didn't do a very good job with it. I will insert a picture of what I looked like it down. before these two weeks. So that concludes the two weeks of the Chloe Ting ab workout series. I'm feeling good. Um, I think part of that was definitely my diet. I cleaned it up from the holidays and tried to eat as clean as possible. Without further ado, I think we should just look at my results. <laughs> So you can definitely so see that red. I have definition. I'm not bloated. I've eaten today, so it's not like I haven't eaten. Um, but yeah, so this is what we're looking like. So we're just a lot more toned. <laughs> wow, it looks.
look so amazing. I'm, I'm like speechless right now because it looks so freaking amazing. Guys, go send Ashley some love because she did so amazing. Just two weeks, guys. Two weeks. If she can do it, so can you. Don't procrastinate. I'm telling myself that too. Don't procrastinate. Just do it. The first few days are always the hardest. You can check out her video for her full journey. Oh, I don't think she talks in this video, so we're just gonna jump straight into her results. Oh my god! This is really incredible! Oh my god! Her results are so impressive! Her ab definition, her butt definition, and you know the line over here, like the back row? <laughs> They're all gone! The side. It's amazing, guys. Look how little it looks. I have never been this, I've never had a skinny waist like this before. This is the front. Look at those abs. Look at this side. Alright, girl. I just wanna say a few things because I think your result is so amazing. You only did one workout of the whole program, just 10 minutes. For two weeks and your results so impressive. Your butt looks amazing, your abs look amazing, oh my god! <laughs> this is why I do what I do, this makes me so happy. You can see her face lit up, like at the end of the 14 days, she's so happy. Girl, I'm so proud of you, I love you, I'm really happy for you and yeah, keep going. Chloe. Chloe does the body good. <laughs> Ab challenge by Chloe Ting. She really makes you challenge your body. Exhibit A, how I challenge my body. Oh girl, I need a oh, pole dancing the most class. Workout was that it was only 10 minutes. You only needed 10 minutes to complete this workout. On those days when I didn't go to the gym, it wasn't like there was a wrench thrown in my day at any point in time. Like, oh my God, I gotta do this challenge. It was like 10 minutes. That's 10 minutes you would have been sitting on Instagram. That's three songs. It takes no time out of your day. You can easily squeeze it into your routine. It wasn't fun to begin with because during the first couple of days, I really struggled. Target your abs with every workout. It really wasn't to be fucked with. First two days, I was like, oh shit, we got me fucked up. Because I was in all types of pain. I couldn't even laugh. I couldn't even laugh without being in pain. No pain, no gain. Let me show you how Chloe Ting got me smashed. From this side, you can oh, see that please. little definition. Wow, I love like, the oblique. Oh, Look at that. Look at that. Girl. I don't have a six pack, but. So toned though. It's poking. It's coming through. I got some little fake cuts. Chloe, Chloe knows what she's talking about. <laughs> One thing I really loved yeah, about I this know. workout also <laughs> is that Chloe, she made sure that she targeted those <laughs> stubborn ass lower abs. There's so many workouts out there, so many fitness gurus and they will give you all these ab workouts to do and guess what, you will forever have that little fupa at the bottom. Fupa. And my fupa wasn't crazy, but you know, it was a little something something. I felt like it was more than it needed to be. And after the two weeks, it's like, my fupa is like, I can show you. Okay, what's a fupa? Like, I gotta Google this. Johnny has such a giant fupa, he probably can't see his coat to take a piss. <laughs> <laughs> Why would someone use that as a definition, like an explanation for fupa? Okay, so basically it is just the fat upper pelvic or pubic area. So right here, your lower belly. How did I not know this? I should know these things. What well, fupa, baby? I could barely, there's nothing to grab. Hopefully she has some booty workouts because I'm trying to get some, trying to get some booty. I do have a booty program, Kurgi, and you're gonna love it. Speaking of booty workouts, we are gonna look at some booty results. I decided to do Chloe Ting's 100 glute bridges a day challenge. I want you guys to see what happens if I see any changes. I'm gonna measure myself right now first. And I'm gonna see the time of day and stuff and make sure it's accurate and show you guys like the befores and afters. I'm still gonna be doing my normal workouts that I do. So that might help with the growing process. So when I did this challenge, I was doing my normal routine and I just added this after my workouts. So remember to do this on top of your current routine because if you don't, then you're probably not gonna see much of a result. But if you're new to working out, then doing the glute bridge challenge is totally gonna be okay because you're yeah, new to working out. And also remember, you gotta eat more because if you wanna grow muscles, you gotta eat a little bit more to grow that muscle, you know what I mean? So I'm 35 and a half, about like right here. Okay, so here are all the variations that she had um, on her video. Um, they just rotate 
um, throughout the, each week, so each seven days, so each one is different. And these are pretty awkward movements, but just keep doing it. No one cares. No one cares what you look like. It doesn't really matter. Yeah, um, it's awkward, but yeah, keep thrusting. <laughs> so cute, kawaii. So today was the last day that I finished my challenge, and I will show you guys the results. I'm gonna wear the same, the exact same thing I wore, so you guys could like really see the difference. Nice booty, girl. Like you have a nice booty to begin with. Ooh, Three six and a half, right? She was there. thirty-five and a half inch, and now she's thirty-six and a half inch. I don't know. After I've been working out for a while, that's actually a lot for like how small my body is. I'm pretty proud. I think I grew one inch in a month as well, and that's really really hard. So my biggest advice is to make sure to eat. Don't go on a restricted diet or why not, especially when you're trying to grow your glutes. Um, and also don't be. You know, don't compare your progress with someone else's progress. I think some people grew like two or three inches. But obviously, it's a little bit easier when you are a beginner to grow your glutes. Or it could be a lot harder because you don't have much glute muscle to start with. So yeah, just want to say, don't compare yourself. Like everyone's going to grow at a different rate. Everyone's going to get leaner at a different rate. Hi guys, it's Alex. I started on January 17th and these were what I looked like. I don't like the back fat. I kind of had a fat roll. <laughs> I kind of got stretch marks and I'm like, I am way too young to be having that. To go along with my weight loss journey, I... Got a little package here. I ordered myself a workout set, but if they're like over $50, then I probably won't get it because I think that's way too much to spend on just like workout clothes. So guys, I did a little wardrobe cleanup recently and I read the comments a lot of people want my clothes. Um, they wish that they had some of my clothes. So I actually donated a lot of my clothes, but I kept like a little bit. I'm gonna be streaming live on Twitch. I'll be giving away my workout clothes and also some of my other clothes as well. So do check out my Twitch. So moving on, this is after a week. I will put my photos here so you can see them. And Honestly, I can already feel a difference in my body. It may not look like it in the pictures, but definitely I feel it and I just feel a lot better and more strong. And yeah, you can see my little line. Oh yeah. I have this like fat roll that's like above my bigger fat roll. So <laughs> that so is getting smaller. Yeah, line is and then my there. back fat roll is getting a lot smaller. Yeah, that's right. And that's only one week. So it inspired me to do this challenge per se is because I saw Chloe Ting's workouts being done and people showing their results and I was like, I could do this. Yes, you can. And now you're in one of my results video. We're all gonna be supporting you and watching you through your journey. So keep going, you can do this. It is hard, but it is gonna be worth it. Send her some love, guys. Go to the channel. Chloe Ting is where it's at. She knows, she knows what we want and she gives it yes. to us. And that's what we need, that mind-muscle connection. Mind-muscle you know, connection. <laughs> I say that all the time So yes. now for the part that you guys it's have been time. waiting for is it's my results. Time. When I started the program, I weighed in at 69.6 kilograms, which is 153 pounds. Um, my butt measured at 40 inches and my waist measured at 28 and a half inches. I had awful, awful, awful hip dips before this challenge my hip dips and how they were um and then in comparison to what they look oh my like god now, girl you have no way, hip dips anymore i was at 65.5 kilograms so in total i lost 4.1 kilograms almost 10 pounds is what i lost doing the chloe ting challenge for 35 days and that was with me eating whatever i wanted not being cautious and for my butt i did end up gaining one inch which i am super 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 pleased about because i didn't actually think i would gain anything at all because i have been doing like leg workouts at the gym for the longest time and gaining nothing like literally nothing i saw no improvement so it's amazing that i saw improvement in 35 days girl you did amazing like that's super impressive you lost some fat but also built a booty so i know a lot of you guys often ask me about growing a booty get rid of hip dips and also get a smaller waist at the same time so do check out her journey to learn more and yeah me, my mom and my dad trying the two-week Chloe Ting ab workout. I love how her mom already pulled out. <laughs> Nathan Swift here, getting ready to do the Chloe T challenge. I'm being forced against my will by my daughter. She's 15. Scary. So I'm hoping for like muscle toning. It's really nice to see family doing my workouts together. I wish that I could convince my my family to do it with me. <laughs> 
Wow, that was really difficult. Is that how everyone feels when they do my workout? I only took a break like two times, so that was pretty impressive. Oh. Not too. That was. <laughs> I just realized today that this has more episodes. So like on day one, you're supposed to do two. On day two, you're supposed to do three. They have like certain videos for certain days, but we're just gonna stick to the one video, just the one 10 minute ab workout. And we're gonna see how that goes. So guys, yeah, you can just follow the schedule or just adjust it based on how you're feeling. But if you want maximum results or if you don't know what to do, following the schedule might help. Today, so much harder than yesterday. But I thought yesterday was bad. Today was worse. Just on top of the sore muscles already. <laughs> I love her laugh. She's always uh, <laughs> like she's struggling, but she's laughing at the same time. I oh my god, results! Yay. I'm so excited. I'm all done. I did all 14 days. I never missed a day. I'm you so excited. Really it nice. feels great to have known that I did that and stuck through it. It progressively got easier as the days went by. So that is nice. Wow, two inches for that. Great job, Nathan. Nathan lost two inches on the waist. That's really amazing in just 14 days, like seriously. And Mackenzie got a lot more tone. She was already toned to begin with, but she got more tone. So that's really, really impressive. I'm so happy for Nathan and Mackenzie. Like I need to get my dad on here. Get him to do my workouts. <laughs> We do that all the time, don't we? Squishing our belly and our worst time. Wow! Holy crap! You look so much leaner! I wasn't expecting the result in the first couple of minutes, but oh my god, that's really amazing! <laughs> my bed is legitimately right here and I just have to crawl over here and I just did not want to do that. So I wanted to record the first day and the last day just in case I didn't get the results I wanted. I still wanted to be able to see the things you can't see. So yourself getting stronger. Sometimes I'm really hard on myself and I don't see the results that I want right away and I neglect that I'm actually getting stronger and putting in the effort and trying. So I should be proud of myself for that at the very least. I can totally see from your form that you have gotten so much stronger. It's not always about how we look, it's about how we feel. The reason why I got into fitness, I really wanted to feel stronger. So yeah, I'm really, really happy that you, you mentioned that because that's actually really, really important. Important. It's not just about the physical appearance. <laughs> like, it was really weird because after every workout, I'd be like, man, that was so hard. I bet I have abs already. And I would go to this mirror over here and I would like lift up my shirt and just be like so disappointed that there weren't any abs yet. But like, of course, you're not gonna get abs after like one 20 minute workout. <laughs> I don't know if other people feel that way or I'm just like a super impatient and practical individual. I feel like we all do that. Sometimes you look more bloated after like a cardio workout because you're breathing in so hard. And sometimes after an ab workout, you look more defined. So like, it really depends. A lot of you guys always ask me that like, oh, why do I look more bloated after I work out? Because you just did a massive workout, like you're breathing in and out. You worked your muscles, so there's gonna be a little bit of inflammation, there's a bit of water retention around the area, but it's gonna, like, it's gonna pass. So don't worry about that. Results takes time. I've had a lot of different feelings about my body and I'm not like ashamed of my body at all. I just think that I don't treat it the way that I should and that's more what this is about rather than trying to see my body looking like an Instagram model or something. I think I've gotten myself to a place where I do love my body as it is, but that doesn't mean that you can't try to improve yourself or be more healthy. I wore the same clothes as the first day to try and best show the differences. Still about at the 32, 31 and a half. I do feel like there's been some progress and maybe I'm just not the best at seeing it in myself. Most of the results videos you see on YouTube are crazy amazing results because why would anyone want to post any differently? Um, that's kind of why I decided I'm gonna put this video up. Um, you'll see that my measurements, I ended up pretty much staying the same. I thought, you know, I still wanted to upload this video just so that you guys can see another person getting through the challenge in their own way and that it's not all about 
like your waist or your weight or whatever it may be. For me, this challenge definitely taught me a lot about like the things that my body can do and I wanted to post this as a celebration of me completing the 30 days and um, not giving up and a celebration of the fact that not everybody is going to get crazy results but it's a great way to get started getting back into fitness. She summarized it so well like not everyone's going to have drastic results. Just because these girls have amazing results doesn't mean that everyone is going to have it. Everyone's going to react to workouts differently. The most important thing like she said is that you're doing it for the right reason. Ellen, thank you so much for creating this video because now I can share your video with other people that are watching my video because everyone has different results and I don't want everyone to have this crazy expectations of how someone should look like after 14 days of working out 30 days. It's about realistic expectations and also realistic goals. I'm so proud of you and thanks for keeping it real. And yeah, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I have tons of results video that I haven't even got to watch yet so i'm gonna be making more results videos so do watch out for that and also i have a new program coming out in a couple of weeks so watch out for that too and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed today's video do check out my twitch if you want to see some live workouts or if you want to get some free gym gear or clothing check these girls out give this video a thumbs up and i'll see you in the next video bye